find the one, you should never give her up. Guys, welcome to this vlog. So I'm really happy this morning, but I hope that the happiness lasts because this vlog is going to be about my COVID story. I hope it's negative. If it's negative, but I post the vlog. It's not my sense. <laughs> or maybe you guys want to see what happens when people get tested for COVID. So I'm going to be showing you. So in two weeks time, my class was supposed to go to Kedere. That is a village in Ogoni for our rural post. So they want to make sure that we don't infect the elderly that are there and everything. So, Auntie! <laughs> Nobody, right? Sorry, I'm here. Sorry, I'm here. Okay, guys, so we're back. Uh -huh. So we have to test and make sure we don't infect those that are in Kedere. That's the village we're going to. So, every member of my class is supposed to get tested. And then, if we're positive, we're supposed to self isolate. Then, hopefully, we'll get better before we have to go to the villages and the village and everything. So, I'm currently walking to where we're supposed to get tested. They made us, I think, they want us to fill this form. It's a COVID 19 surveillance standard operating procedure. I don't know what that means, but I'll go through it, I'll read it. Ah, ah Jesus. <laughs> Number one question is current status. Alive or dead? I don't understand. <laughs> Guys, this, this one is this one is crazy. Okay, so let me walk to uh, here. I'll show you guys a clip of the isolation center here in UPTH. So this is I mean UP, UPTH, that's where we learn in the teaching hospital. So I'll try and show you. I think this video is noisy. Sorry guys, this video is just, I don't know, rough and everything, but I'm walking on the street, so what do you expect? So I'll show you the isolation center. I can already spot it. So yeah. So guys, we are getting close to the isolation center. So just for precautions, I've worn my face masks. <laughs> Forget about vlog. Let me not go and catch COVID. <laughs> so let me just show you. It's labeled isolation and treatment. So I don't know if you can see this. Yeah. So guys, let's see what do access to do. I can see my colleagues ready to get tested. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> I'm about to fill my form to get tested. I should have videoed my colleagues, though, but these people say that they not give me consent, you know, so <laughs> so I can't video them. So, guys, I'm really, I'm, I'm a bit scared. I'm a bit worried. Like, how would the testing? Because I've heard that. It's very discomforting. You know, they have to put something in your nose, through your nose to get to your throat. Abby? Abby, please, what? Did you put something? Uh -huh. So I don't know how that's going to feel. I don't want to go through anything. I've already taken my vaccines, and that's enough thing for COVID. So <laughs> I don't want somebody poking something inside my nose and getting it to, no, 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 no. So guys, I'll try and record, make videos of everything, the whole process, so you know how the COVID testing works and everything. Meanwhile, let me fill my form. So guys, we've been here for a while. I know I came here around 10. This is, this is, I think this is 12. This is 12, 30 and I'm still here. The only thing that has been done, we've been given numbers, hi Shalom, and then we've been given this bottle, right? I think it's supposed to be the cultural medium. They call it, what? It's labeled UTM transport medium. So I guess they'll put the sample in it. So it has all our names, it has my name, Mimi Amakre. So yeah. Hi, Beth. <laughs> So I think now they are ready to start. So we've been here since and they're just starting around 12 30. I'm not even sure they're going to start. But I'll try and so guys right now we're standing in line for sample collection. So yeah, let me show patient entrance. My mom is outside. 
guys. Ma? I got give me your bottle. Okay. Sorry. Okay. I'll start with your nose. Have you done this test before? No, I haven't done the test before. Okay, I'll start with your nose and we'll give you two tests for your RDT and PCR. Yes, the RDT will come out in the next 10 to 20 minutes. Then your PCR will come out maybe in the next two days. You can call for this. Call yes, for ma'am. Call for me. Okay. Then, now I'm collecting nose and one for me. Mouth. mouth. And we're starting with the PCR. Remove your nose now. Raise your head up. Or collect or something. Can you turn this way? Remove your nose now from the time. Okay. And raise your head up. Face me small. Shift your hand down so that I will not touch you. Sorry. Sorry. It's uncomfortable. Sorry. Sorry. Close your mouth, please. Well, being a medical student, I just feel like this particular place in put it must just be my nasal pharynx. So it's part of my pharynx. But guys, I don't think naturally anything is supposed to go into that place. Because it is it is greatly discomforting. It's bordering near pain. But it's just, it's just not comfortable at all. Face me, face me, face me, let me be single. Down to your throat. I'm acting, me, Crystal. Again. Yes, my eyes are smart. It's really not cool. So, guys, I'm just coming out. It's not so cool. I have hands and tied in my bag. Guys. See what my mother I want to take my hands and tie that in my bag. There is no soap. <laughs> Guys, this is real what I'm going through here. My family's hands. Okay. Where? Okay. Guys, so I hope it's not positive. At least this rapid one. I want to just stay here a while and get the results first. Yes. Are you going to allow me to video you? No. 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 Then, then go and ask, go and ask Shalom. Please now. Oh yeah, let me answer. I'm videoing myself. Yes, it's very and it's very uncomfortable, and it's go deep. Through your nose. And they'll do it four times. One here, one here, one here. It's not for. I'm sorry. They did it one in this small street. She was targeting you. She didn't even target them. What time? They put it in seven. Am I right? No, she was. She was wearing a net. So. Guys, she put one here. No, no, she's more. She's more. She's more gentle than that now. She she put one in one nose. She put again. Brought another one again. Put here again. Put here again. It's deep. Oh. Ah, you feel like pushing her hand away and everything. Oh no! No, not give her anesthesia. No, no, no. What do you say? This is our. What's my? What's our? I don't know. I don't know. This is our. This kind. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. It's not. It's not. It's something that it's not. Even, it's not even painful, but it's just uncomfortable. Very uncomfortable. But it's not painful. I'm waiting to see my rapids. Okay.
The rapid test come out immediately. Okay, we'll come out today. That's why they did it to they did it twice. It knows one. They'll do mouth. Okay, they will first of all do nose. They put here, put here. They will not do mouth. That one is for the PCR testing. Then they will not take another one again for the rapid testing and do nose. Yeah. I just pray don't vomit. So how did you feel? Guys, they're calling me for my results, the rapid. <laughs> my heart is lucky, racing, lucky, because I know that it's not the end of the world, even if I'm positive. I did two tests for you. Yes, ma'am. Sure, I told you. You told me, ma'am. Okay, you have this test. You have to edit Negative. Mm. Thank God. So, wait for the system. For my any chance, the PCR will be positive. It's possible. This is not set. PCR is the end of the because it's a peak um, the virus. But this one is, it's not really easy to set. It's a little bit more. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. So guys, my rapid was negative. We thank God. Shalom, it's your turn. Ma has called her, she's coming. Please, no paper, I need no paper. It's going round. Guys, let me pack my things and go.